I'm so excited for our morning makeover. Okay, so I'm gonna go through a few things that I want you to know to help you get started so you're all ready to go on Monday. So this is a five-day free group of really motivated people. So it's you and a lot, lots of other really motivated people who are ready to learn and implement strategies to help you get up, ready to go in the morning, get your head in the right place so you can honestly take those steps forward to living your best life. I know for me, I used to be a snoozer. Like I would hit the snooze button forever. Like literally, I wanna say sometimes for an hour. Isn't that so silly just hearing myself say that out loud? It's kind of embarrassing. But I would get up at the last possible second that I had to and I'd convince myself I didn't need to wash my hair or I'd, I don't know, like I just convinced myself that I needed to sleep longer for whatever reason. And then my entire day was completely reactive and I was always like behind and it was really frantic and crazy, especially when I had kids, because if I didn't have enough time in the morning for me, then I was losing my temper and I was getting frustrated with them as well. So a few years ago, I started committing to getting up at least one hour before I really needed to get up to get ready for work. And in that time, that's where I found some of these positive habits that have literally impacted everything about my life. When I was doing that, I was building a side business in health and fitness as I was also working a full-time job as a teacher. And I was really passionate about building this full-time or this side business into a full-time business, but I couldn't find any more time in the day because I was teaching high school English, bringing papers home and, and having meetings and, and parent conversations and meeting with kids and all kinds of stuff, right? But what I found was if I got up earlier in the day, I was so much more focused, so much more productive, so much more positive, had so much more energy, I was more likely to exercise. I was more likely to make better decisions in terms of doing things and taking action towards reaching the goals in my side business. And so in the more early morning hours, I wasn't necessarily working on my business. Sometimes I did, and sometimes I still do, but it was what I was doing for me in those early morning hours that created so much clarity and space in my head also a lot more confidence in myself um, to be able to make my part-time side business a full-time career and I was able to retire from teaching at the age of 36. So I can honestly say that these miracle morning or morning makeover techniques, they have truly transformed my life and have helped me to get where I am today, which is a business owner and entrepreneur of an online health and fitness business where I do make multiple six figures. There's so much more that's gone into it than that. But the, these strategies that I'm going to teach you are a huge part of my success, our routine, our system, the way we take care of ourselves. So I can't stress enough, no matter how big or small your goals are, right, that you really taking part in this and implementing these strategies and making them a habit really can forever change your life if after our five days you keep going okay you keep going this is what i do daily you'll see if you follow me on instagram you see me hold myself accountable to my morning makeover activities um, I also have a group of coaches that I work with where we all hold ourselves accountable to getting up. We actually have a small message strand where we say, I'm up, I'm up, I'm up, because accountability is where it's at. And that's why I'm so extremely grateful to create an accountability group for you to get up and get these activities done in the morning so you can start your day right, okay? So I wanna kinda tell you what to expect in our group. So. We are, we have a small private Facebook group. And if you haven't requested to join, the link is in this email and I want you to request to join as soon as possible. Okay. That's where all the magic is going to happen and the fun is going to go down. Okay. That's where we are going to show up daily and hold ourselves accountable to our morning makeover activities. Okay. Our morning makeover activities are super simple. They're very easy. I think you need at most an hour to get this done. 
So the very first thing you're going to have to do is decide what your wake up time is. And I'll ask you about this later on, but right a little bit closer to the time where we get started. So you can just think about it for now, but I'm going to ask you your wake up time and I'm going to encourage you to make it one hour before you need to start getting ready, jumping in the shower for work, okay, or whatever, wherever you need to be, or whoever you need to put your hat on for whomever that day, okay? So you need one hour, one hour. And if you wanna get in a workout, maybe you need a little bit more time, unless you're doing Transform 20, and it's a 20 minute workout, which is beautiful, because that, would, that was perfect with these kind of activities. So what you're gonna be doing during this hour of time in the morning, is you're gonna peel your eyes open. You can feel free to make a pot of coffee or you can have your favorite pre-workout energized, which is what I drink every morning during my morning makeover time. Um, and you are going to hold yourself accountable to the items on our journal, which is part of your attachment here. You'll need to print out your journal. It's five pages, one page for each day. If you wanna do this in your own notebook or journal, feel free, you don't have to make any prints or printouts, okay? So the teacher in me is loving this, by, by the way. Like, this was super fun for me to create for you. So we are going to write down our wake-up time. We are going to write down five things we're grateful for. I'm going to go into more of these details as we go through our morning makeover in our group. You are going to recite affirmations, which I have a printout for you of affirmations. Okay, it's one of your printouts. You're gonna decide what your three most important tasks are that day and write them down. You're gonna watch a personal growth video. Usually they're like two to five minutes long and I have them all for you, again, on one of the attachments. And you're gonna tell us your takeaways, okay? Then you're gonna write down your five big goals. Like these are goals that are like your goals this year, your goals in five years, your goals in 10 years. Hey, if you got more than five, go for it. I have a list of 10, but you're gonna write down your goals and literally you're gonna write the same goals down every single day because every day that I write down, we are debt free. The more it stays into my head, the more that I make conscious decisions in spending and in saving that will get us closer to being a debt free family. So I write, we are debt free down every single day and I have all year long, okay? Then your two optional tasks are to read a devotional, which I do, I'm currently reading one called Saver, and your other one is to get in a workout, okay? Now, if you wanna do a workout afterwards or at the end of your day, cool, you can do it later. I highly recommend doing one earlier in the day because it really does set you up for success. And if you want a trial, a free trial, totally can get a 14 day free trial to Beachbody On Demand, which is my digital platform that I use every day. You can try it out for free. Let me know because then you could have a workout to do in the morning, just like I'm gonna do, okay? So this is what you're gonna be doing. You're gonna set your alarm for an hour earlier. You're gonna get your morning makeover tasks completed. And then you're gonna notice this in the group every single morning at 4.30 a.m. I've got it scheduled for your accountability. Okay, your check-in. As soon as you're done with your morning makeover activities, you're gonna take a photo. And you can be in it or not, a selfie mode, I don't care. You're gonna take a photo, okay, and you're gonna upload it, and you're gonna share it. And don't worry, there, no one's gonna read it, it's not meant to judge or, just do it, okay? Hold yourself accountable. And if you don't wanna share what you wrote down, then just take it out of yourself with your coffee or your energize, it doesn't matter to me. But you are gonna hold yourself accountable to getting up early, doing these simple tasks that are gonna get your head in the right place every single day. I'm so excited, more info's coming. I'm gonna break down and teach each of these components to you in our group, but you know what? I don't believe that you need to have it all figured out before you do it. You just need to take action. You need to be open and willing to do something new if you wanna make changes in your life. If we keep doing the same things over and over, we're never gonna make changes and grow and evolve. And guess what? You don't need to have all the answers. You need to be okay with being uncomfortable and trying something new and just doing it, okay? So this is what you need on Monday, okay? There's your five-page journal, as well as your printouts for your daily affirmations and your personal development videos. You need to have an alarm clock ready to go and you need a request to join the group. I'm gonna send you a little bit more information in the next day or two, 
but I'll see you in the group and I'll see you on Monday morning. You don't have to wake up at 4.30 a.m. My wake up time will be between 5 and 5.30 a.m., but that first post will go up starting our accountability thread for each day of our five days. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. If you have any questions, definitely let me know. I'll see you later.